we know that everywhere, almost everywhere in the world, uh, human life is getting longer and longer. It's people are living longer and the question, a big question here is actually are they living a healthy life? Family? And that means it also brings uh, tremendous challenges like in terms of health care, pensions, social care, their health, you know, health and well-being, emotional well-being and so on. Southampton, I would say that has, has taken a huge, you know, huge role as well as the leadership to actually promote work on uh, you know, healthy aging or on population dynamics. So we have the Center for the ESRC Center for Population Change, uh, the uh, Center for Research on Aging, the, the Care Life Cycle Center. They're all doing wonderful work, uh, particularly you know, dealing with lots of complexity analysis. The life that we are going to face in the future is going to be very complex and there's a lot of uncertainty. And we need to bring, I mean, any statistical modeling that people do would need to address those complexity. So there are a group of people, it's multidisciplinary because, you know, there's a, a group of people from, even engineers are, are working with social scientists to address this problem. And I think it is the right uh, direction. There is an MSc in Demography, MSc in Global Aging, uh, MSc in Global Health. All these programs actually bring together uh, a multidisciplinary as well as, as well as interdisciplinary and more research-led uh, uh, you know, topics uh, that students would find it challenging. Uh, and again, in these MSCs, they are exposed to the real-life problems. So they, they are exposed to complex problems. They will be given the real data to do the analysis so it's not that they will they will be doing this analysis when they you know go out to the employers they're already doing it so the msc in global health for instance is a program that brings in together uh, academic and research staff from five faculties and the one of the institutes so the five faculties are faculty of social and human sciences that's where i'm based in and faculty of medicine faculty of health sciences faculty of uh, engineering and environment Faculty of uh, Business and Law and the Global Health Research Institute. So the students will get that experience interacting with these all these research-led, leading world-class uh, academic researchers and, and that will be a significant advantage for their learning and for their future careers. Thinking about uh, how to live longer, not just longer but also healthier, there's one, uh, one uh, academic solution to that is that the first is actually to be happy all the time. So happiness is actually happiness which is actually measured more holistically in a kind of in, a, in, in the subjective well-being format is fundamental. So the hap so how do how do people gain a happiness is is having a balance between work life, family life, as well as you know maintaining a good uh, you know concept about life.